Hey guys, hey, this is Nay. Follow me on IG, Twitter, and Periscope, and Nay Rob on YouTube. Now, let's talk power. Okay, guys, Um, the first thing I want to say is shout out to my girl, Kim. I was at the beauty salon the other day, and not the beauty salon, the nail salon, and Kim had was like, uh, don't don't I know you? I think I seen you today. You do YouTube videos. And I was, yeah. And it was kind of nice to be, you know, recognized. And it was so funny. We were talking about how, um, how, um, you know, we don't, people say that, you know, people from the DMV have accents, but we never hear it in ourselves, but we can hear it in other people. And it was strange. I was hearing her talk. I was like, God dang, we do got a thick accent, but what up, Kim? What up, good? Um, you know, on another video, I had said that that um, I was so, you know, distraught about what happened with my phone. Child, I drank too many beers, went to the daggone game, put the phone in my back pocket turned around and squatting bloop you know and then I was in my feelings but I was blessed one of my subbies blessed me and that's all I can say you know just when you think life is just a hot ball of pee pee you know people bless you so at any rate let's talk about jay-z versus kanye okay so um i was listening to carcino and carcino has like seventy three thousand subscribers and coming to find out he is subscribed to me and wow so I was, anyway, I was listening to one of his, uh, well, I was listening to several of his videos uh, this weekend. And one of them that moved me enough to make this video was uh, the video, I think it was titled Jay-Z Hates Kanye, I'm not sure. But um, at any rate, he was explaining how when Jay-Z and Kanye was doing the Watch the Throne um, watch the throne album. They were in Hawaii and they were doing that album together, but they were working on separate, um, on separate, on separate albums themselves. So I think Jay-Z was working on, I can't think of the name of the, the music piece. It was, um, but anyway, it was the one with Holy Grail on it. And Kanye heard four songs that were on um, Jay-Z's solo piece. And and um, Kanye was like, look, we need to get that over here. Bring that here. We need to put this on Watch the Throne. And um, Jay-Z was like, no, that's not what we want to do. So Jay-Z was like, it was like pretty heck watching him stomp around and you know fuss around like he's a child because he wanted to get those four songs on watch the throne jay-z was flat out like no fire when they say no they mean no god dang it you ain't gonna get it with us air you know you work on us a little bit we just be like okay all right we easily sway you know easily unless it's something we really really feel passionate about but you know, we wake up wanting to see red and then go to sleep wanting to see Jay Z blue. being the businessman that he is. And he, um, you know, he made a good choice for himself. You know, these songs are not going on the Watch the Throne, the songs are going on my work, not our work. That's not what I'm trying to do. So you go on back over there and your musical, magical. You know, fairy tale castle and me. You oh, make Kanye, your beats. no matter how crazy he is. Oh, he is a bad mother sucker when it comes down to producing. That's not. That's not. And I think you know what was that? Um. Oh, it was a picture, and it was Kanye, Jay Z, Beyonce, and Kim Kardashian sitting together. And child, you know they terrible. I think they said anyway. Kanye had the most Grammys out of everybody on the. You know, out of the four. You know. He was saying Kim got a sex tape, but I'm gonna talk about Kim a little bit later. But um, yeah, you know, like Kanye is he's 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 a master when it comes down to music and and you know creativity. He's just that guy, and 
you know, Jay-Z is not stupid. He's a business guy. The Sagittarius, they're about that bottom line. They don't care about who's going to hurt or what it looks like. They don't care. Jay-Z cares about the bottom line. And believe me, oh, he'll be an a-hole. That, that's what I'm saying. I don't know why, you know, Beyonce, the Virgo, deals with Jay-Z. I don't know how she do it because they are passionate but anyway, i don't see how she copes with him because you know virgo women are overly critical of themselves they do so much to try to please and you know help people and you know just be there and support people and um you know to have to go home and hear that fool complaining about something and you know, everything just be wrong. They just always got something to say. And I'd be ready to just smack a Sagittarius in the mouth, even though I would be with one because we daggone sure would be taking care of you. He's flying to the moon. Oh, he will woo you. A Sagittarius will woo you. I ain't saying I wouldn't date Jay-Z. That's not what I'm saying because I told y'all I've messed with a Sagittarius before that flew me to fucking Africa. Okay? I'm just saying, I'm, you know, it's it's ups and downs. Oh, he gonna fly you everywhere. He might not marry you. Okay. But you dang on will won't have to you have to deal with that mouth because they got a mouth child they got a mouth I said mm -hmm. like I, the way that you know how hard hard you know virgos are on themselves and then you got some fool with you that's you know about business and that's why i say i really believe that uh jay-z told her cut matthew nose off you belong to me now i own you girl cut him off tell your daddy goodbye bye daddy bye you know that's how I feel, you know. I'm in charge of you now. I run you. I'm your business person. You, we own you. Rock Nation owns you. Call your daddy. You know, beep, 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 beep. Kim Kardashian dad. is not a um, Beyonce. She's not, but she's a, a a Beyonce to Kanye, and you can't take that from him. That's who he believes in. That's who he wants. That's who his muse is whereas jay-z is looking at his woman as a powerful force kanye just wants somebody that he can be inspired by which takes me to his rant where he was like um uh, you know that man my wife got robbed and all he did was just call and say you know j just call and said uh y'all okay okay all right bye and kanye took it personally you know that's because you know, things, certain things matter to us. You know, certain things matter to air signs. As you see, Kanye is already a, a, a horrifically, you know, emotional, uh, irrational person. And Jay-Z and, and, and Beyonce, they just seem like this unemotional uh, couple, you know, whereas Kanye and Kim, they have feelings, they have emotions. And they're not afraid to put it into the universe. That doesn't make them less than Jay-Z and Beyonce. They are who they are. And J and B are who they to are. Be compared. You know, they're two separate powers on different sides. You know, that's fire and that's air. Who runs their relationship is fire. Who, won, who runs Kanye and Kim's relationship is air. They're thinking about butterflies and 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 rainbows kanye and i'm sorry jay-z and and b are thinking about money that's what they think that's what runs their relationship money power business that's what runs them you know what runs kim and kanye snicker balls oh in reality tv Kanye was so in his feelings because he didn't come past. And and I'm telling you, the Sagittarius, Jay-Z didn't think he did anything wrong. He was like, you know, I called him. What you what you want me to do? Bake you a cake? Put it in an oven? What you want so, me to do? You know, and then let's not, you know, forget about the fact that everybody like looking at Kim sideways like, girl, you sure you was wrong? Was that your cousin, girl? Don't do that. Don't be, um, you know, he's like, our kids don't even play together. I don't think he care. You know, they don't, they don't care. They not on the same stuff as you, Kanye. That's, that's not your friend. Y'all are partners. Y'all are music partners. I don't even think Jay-Z take the music as serious as Kanye does. I don't think he does. I think like Kanye is there. 
He's thinking about how to move the universe without touching it. Jay-Z is about how can I make as much money from the universe, squeeze every drop of money, and how can me and my family get this scroll? I just, they just, it just fire and air just thinks differently. That's all. You know, I'm not trying to make enough excuses for Kanye's irrational behavior because that Negro. It's all over the place. Didn't I tell y'all that them Geminis are the sexy psychopaths? Them moves. I don't know. You know, I, I don't you know. You know, just he doesn't, he doesn't, Kanye doesn't understand Jay-Z. And Jay-Z doesn't care that Kanye doesn't understand. Okay. Many right, guys. Remember this. The same people you meet on the way up are the same people you meet on the way down. YouTubers. Let's be good to each other. Peace.